Welcome back to Prepping the Truth Homestead. I'm Jeff, her husband, and I'm going to film her some and everything and do some vacuum sealing. She's already done a bunch tonight. If you're brand new to this channel, we want you part of this channel. we love for you to hit the subscribe button. And uh, my channel is Storm of Truth Preparedness. I definitely want you there too. I'd love for you to be at both channels. And thank you in advance. All right, let's cross over and we're going to find out what else she's vacuum sealing out. We're going to show you the whole process. Here's a bunch more she's already done just to last a little bit. There's raisins, dates, granola, elbow macaroni, pasta shells, flour, and a bunch of other stuff. Okay. It's going to get loud too in a second, but we're going to go ahead and show you the whole process. What else she's back saying? What is kind of oats? Oats. Okay. Quick oats is kind of quick oats now. by great value. The ones that's just in these big cardboard tubes. I'll show them. Right They're there. cheap to get. All you gotta do, you just need to put them in something for long term. Them oats are good for you too. We're waiting on the bag to seal. If everybody wonders what we're waiting on, <laughs> this is gonna show you too. Uh, if you're a newbie, you've never done it. It's so simple to do. It's unbelievable. This is a food saver model. In one day's time, you can get so much stuff vacuum sealed. It's on. Believable too. Mm -hmm. Unless you can do it. Alright, cut that. There we go. Okay, all she's got to do is can fill it up. I guess I'm, then we're doing that too. Yeah. And our little daughter is a real good helper too. She, I think she likes it more than us. You might can have a little more. Yeah. That'll be good enough. Too heavy, it won't seal. And it's going to get loud, so I'm going to give you a little heads up to cut the volume down before she starts this. I'm going to back it up so until it is going to get loud. There you go. I guess do one more. Y'all want to do another one? Yeah. All right, if y'all hang in there with us, we're going to do some more. And then dates. A lot of people don't like the taste of dates, but I love the taste of dates. And that granola we're doing is very good. We're going to seal the bottom of that. Just like the oats. That's going to preserve for a long time. Everybody this will. Have to seal that one. And then you pull it out and wait till the light's done again. Yep. There you go. As soon as it cuts off, you can cut it off. Ta-da! Okay, perfect. Okay, they're going to fill another one up. And be ready, it's going to get loud again, so I will back it up some. Good job, Faith. What's coming up next? We're going to do some more of these granolas. I'm going to swap out to the little bags for it, the snack size. Let's see, is that sealed yet around the last bit?
You watching that loud, ain't you, buddy? Yep. That's how you do it. I see you. Yeah, let's try that too. That is peanut butter and chocolate granola. And it's that's good. What's the name of that over there? What kind is that called? It is Cascadian oh, Farm. Yeah, I see her at the Cascadian. I was looking right there. Yeah. Side. She got more on her side. Cascadian Farm. Organic. Peanut butter, chocolate chunk, granola. And we got a deal on it too for the amount. Ready? Ready? Yeah. It's going to be loud. <laughs> Okay, thank y'all so much for watching. And just like I said, if you stuck around this long, be sure and subscribe with us. We want you here. And have a great night.